Well, good evening. This is meteorologist Kerry Cooper. Some beautiful weather across southeast Texas. Lower humidity behind our last cold front. That pollen, man, it's in bad shape. A lot of people coughing and seasoning. Here's why. Trees certainly in that high category as well as the mold. Not a good situation out there. Need some rain to improve that, and that will occur as we head into Thursday and Friday of this week. Now, temperatures are going to be below normal tomorrow. That's nice. We haven't had any below normal days at all. Above normal Wednesday, Thursday. Look how cool for highs for the end of the week and the weekend. We're talking only 50s for highs. That's some 15 to 20 degrees below normal. Same with lows. Well, we're talking some nice, cool weather if you want that. Below normal tonight, tomorrow night. Above normal Thursday. Thursday is going to be windy, warm, and humid. Very tropical-like. Cold front comes in, and it's well below normal for temperatures over days and highs all over the weekend. Rain chances can't rule out a sprinkle for your Tuesday. Nothing Wednesday. 30% on Thursday. Now that jumps to 80% Thursday night into Friday morning. That strong cold front comes in. Could see some one to two inch rains across the area. Disturbances, what we're watching tomorrow uh, coming out of northwest Texas, the Rockies. Pretty good disturbance. So we'll see more clouds tomorrow, what we had today. Then we have high pressure on Wednesday. Then we await our big storm system coming in on Thursday night and Friday, which will give us a pretty good chance. Showers and thunderstorms. Cold front will come through. We'll have the showers and storms. Much, much cooler for the weekend. Disturbances still kind of coming in. We'll have some clouds to deal with too. So Friday and the weekend, it's going to be a chilly one. Future cast tonight, no issues with fog. That's great news. Temperatures dropping on down into the 50s by midnight. Mid 50s will drop into the 40s later tonight near 50. And the triangle will be a cool night, so grab the jacket. Here come the clouds. They'll increase as that disturbance in northwest Texas approaches. We'll see some sun once it moves on out in the afternoon. Once again, a sprinkle is possible for your Tuesday. Not a big, big deal. The low levels of the atmosphere are just way too dry to support any significant rainfall. And as we head into tomorrow afternoon, we'll drop on down into the 50s again by tomorrow night. Marine forecast, small craft advisory. Northeast winds up to 20 knots, water temperature 73. Partly cloudy, windy and cooler tonight. Overnight lows in the low 40s. Lakes, upper 40s in the triangle or mid to upper 40s. It's a chilly night. Tomorrow, not as warm as today. Low to mid 60s. Partly cloudy. It could be mostly cloudy at times. Then the sun will return in the afternoon. And that 10 day forecast will feature. Not really expect any rain through Wednesday. There is a chance Thursday. The best chance, though, as we head into Thursday night into Friday. Pretty good risk of showers and thunderstorms there. We'll keep an eye on any severe weather threats, but there will be a chance as we head into uh, southeast Texas coming up Thursday night into a Friday morning. And some of those storms could be pretty heavy and temperatures in the 40s. Now here's that cool forecast we were showing you a while ago or talking about a while ago, showing you the average highs and lows. Look at the weekend, clouds and sun, some rain Monday, Tuesday. But look at these temperatures, 50s for highs, 40s for lows. That is well below normal for this time of the year. So winter not trying to give up just yet. Of course, we'll be watching the showers and thunderstorms as we head on into Thursday night into Friday morning. So be sure to like us on Facebook, follow us on Twitter, and for weather information 24 hours a day, go to 12newsnow.com.